Is this thing on? Okay. Hey guys, this is Kevin from Real Fragrance Review. Um, today, I bring you an unboxing. The unboxing is from um, Zoologist. I'm actually, oh, this was open, okay. I'm actually, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty, pretty nervous. I got, uh, well, I, first of all, me and the owner, Victor Wong, we are friends on Facebook. So I asked him, I said, hey, I was looking to get into your house of fragrances. And he's like, oh, well, you should try this, this, and this. So I went ahead on his word, and I am going to try it. And this will be a first impression. And um, I, I don't know. I know that it is based off of animals and um, I gotta say the artwork I have seen on his bottles and also from like his notes of fragrances are very very impressive like um, I can tell he puts a lot of care into what he does okay all right, so I did get, oh, I think he sent a few extras. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Wong. Um, ah, did leave me a note. I'll read it. Dear Kevin, thank you for your order. Best regards, Victor. That's cool. That's yeah, actually really nice. It's written on a paper. He wrote it to me. It has um, one of his fragrances, Squid. Um, yeah, it's nice. Um, it shows that he won the Fragrance uh, Foundation Award. Um, he did throw in some samples of, uh, along with the ones I got. So I'm not sure about what I am getting myself into. And that's honest to god i have no idea so i did get camel based on oh sorry let me let me hold on let me focus it real quick come on there we go that's well just camel and then i got rhinoceros based on his recommendations Oh, come on. I'm sorry, my camera has a hard time autofocusing. Maybe. Just know it's a rhinoceros looking. Um, very nice. Um, I'll go over the notes in a minute. I did get some complimentary samples. I do appreciate that. Um... I don't know what he sent. So these were... Oh. I'm sorry. This is a... Uh... It's Yuzu. Okay. So I think this is monkey? This is a monkey? If I, re if I remember correctly, that's a monkey. I'm going to go over the notes real quick of all three of these. Um, I'm going to go rhinoceros first. Um, top notes, pink pepper, whiskey, coffee, rum, basil, leather notes, leather incense, tobacco, absolute, <clears throat> fluvu, ylang ylang, okay, I know ylang ylang, laos oud, patchouli, nagar matha, I have no idea what that is, oak moss and amber, okay. That doesn't sound too bad. Dried fruits. Okay, I'm sorry. This is camel. Well, that one focused. Dried. Fr the top notes are dried fruits, frankincense, palm date, rose, amber, cedar, cinnamon, jasmine, myrrh, orange blossom. Base. Uh, base notes. Oud, civet, musk, sandalwood. Tonka bean, vanilla, and vetiver. Oh boy. Um, 
the monkey one. That's just what I'm going to call it. I'm sorry, Victor. I have no idea how to pronounce it, so I'm just going to go monkey. Uh, the top notes are Japanese yuzu, mandarin, juniper berry, myrrh, hanoki wood, okay, hydrocarbon, resin, that's for the heart notes, sorry. Base notes, new, clendonia, sandalwood, oak moss, absolute, olibanum, and hyper absolute. I have no, I have not I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea what these notes are, but, um, I'm gonna test out two. You know what? I'll test out three. Okay. I'm gonna go Rhino. Oh, shit, I still got the Zhurge off on me. Alright, I'll go Rhino on the top of the hand. Camel over here. Dear Lord, I'm gonna put the monkey one over here. Remember that. Because I probably won't. Alright, here we go. First sprays. Just filling up the room pretty much here. Um... Okay. Uh huh. I'm gonna do one at a time. I'm sorry this is gonna take longer because I know it's gonna take longer. I thought it was gonna be quick, but I have three to do. Very animalic, <laughs> and that's that's definitely the word to describe it. It's very animalic. I can't even lie. Um, definitely get all of the top notes. I'm getting leather, tobacco, uh, flu vu. I have no idea what that is. Ylang ylang, yeah. Um, I can't really talk on the bass notes, so I'm going to spray camel on. Oh, Lord. This is the one with, uh the civet. Okay, let's see how this one goes. <clears throat> I'm, I'm not lying. I'm filling up my my uh, my closet right now where I'm filming. My closet. Yeah, I film in my closet. Ooh, what the hell? Uh, what is that top note? Oh, man, it smells like a... That's interesting. I'll let it dry down. Okay, so... Definitely got into the oud of the rhinoceros. I'm not gonna lie. Heavy oud. Heavy oud. Very barnyardy. Um, hmm. Patchouli's in there, too. I can definitely get the patchouli and the uh, oak moss and the amber. So these dry down qu pretty quick, at least on my skin. So I'm getting, I'm getting a lot. I'm getting, I'm getting cooked, honestly. Oh, okay, the camel's interesting. I don't get much rose, so rose is out of the question. I thought there was gonna be rose and. Sorry, there's not really much rose. At least to my, to me, there's not really much rose. I'm gonna wait for this one to dry down. Time for the monkey. Oh lord, uh, this one was the one that has the um. A lot of it I can't pronounce. So, Godspeed. Here we go, monkey. Um, okay. Actually, the monkey one is the more interesting one. I can't really edit that out. Anyway. Oh, the monkey 
Well, I don't know what the hell is in the monkey one. It's interesting. It's not, um... The yuzu is not that bad. This one's not bad. Like, it's it's wearable. This one, at least. I don't know so much about Campbell or Camel. Well, that Campbell one is drying down pretty funky. Uh, yeah, I think I've gotten into the civet musk. Yeah, I don't I don't know about camel. Sorry, Victor, but um Ooh. Yeah, that is definitely definitely very oody. Oody oody oody. Um still get a lot of leather out of it, I'm not even gonna lie. That leather is probably taking over everything. It don't matter. Honestly, it don't matter what it is, what fragrance, the leather will take over everything. Except for the oud. That oud is strong. That oud is strong. And the patchouli is really strong in it, too. I'm getting some patchouli. Not any wild. Well, I don't know. Yeah, the patchouli does kind of seem wild. Um... I don't know. I don't know about Camel. Camel is um, interesting. It's a different one. But I don't know. <laughs> it's... You know what it is. It's the Civet Musk and Oud mixture I don't think I'm a fan of. And I love Oud. Don't get me wrong. But I think it's the Civet in here that... I'm just not that big of a fan of and I'm I'm not knocking Victor in any way. I'm just I'm just saying I'm not I'm not too big of a fan of uh what he's got in here. But the tonka bean and vanilla. Yeah, that's that's good. That's actually really good. It almost saves it almost. But that that civet is too too strong. And then rhinoceros. I don't know what that uh, second or the third to last one is, but I think it's pretty funky. Like, really, really funky. But, um. Oh, that yuzu one is really good. It's, yeah, the yuzu one is really good. I'm sorry. Let me put this one right here. It's a really good, like,. I could see it being a really good freshie. It's not bad. And I'm I'm actually really surprised with this one. This one is good. This this monkey one, I don't know what the hell it is, but I I'm I'm I may get a bottle of it, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't think it was gonna be uh, I I had no idea. Mr. Victor, that that monkey one is actually better than the ones I bought. Because the ones I bought are pretty wild. And I just don't think they're for me. Sorry, I know this is pretty much a review, but... Um... I'll give it... I'll give it a day. I'll report back in a little... A little tiny almost like a clip of what I think about it cuz I don't know cam okay hold on hold on hold on hold on what am I getting yes okay the Tonka bean vanilla and vetiver combination is now pulling camel back oh my god the civet is just about done. Yeah, that civet was a huge, a huge player in that one. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, that's right. It's the basement notes, so that's okay. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, I, I don't think camel is gonna be for me, and that's just my honest opinion. I'm sorry, Victor, but, um. 
I'm I'm about as honest as anybody and camel is just not for me i think it's i think it's too honestly it's too animalic <laughs> funny i use that word but it's animalic um the civet musk and oud is just a little bit and i mean i can do oud and musk but the civet i just cannot do and i i don't think i'll be able to pull it off i will see I'll see what my girlfriend says about this one, but I don't know. I don't know. That's gonna it's gonna have to go on the back burner. Oh now rhinoceros. Okay, the dry down is actually pretty good. I'm not even gonna lie. It's not the dry down is not bad. The leather has stopped taking it over. And the dry down is pretty bearable. But um I'll have to retest this one and see. I will bring a review out on this one because um, I'm not so sure. And that's just me. I'm not so sure about what I can say about it. And then the monkey one. <clears throat> honestly, the monkey one was the best. Let me zoom in on it. I have no idea what he did with the monkey one. Oh, come on. Okay. Anyway. Just know it's a very... Very, very, very nice monkey. Okay. Anyway. Um. It's really good. The monkey one is really good. And I can see it being a summer banger. But, um... Yeah... I think that is it for me. Yeah, the monkey one is the best, and that is actually very, very odd. It's very odd since it was a complimentary sample, which is really nice for them to do. Thank you, guys, as zoologists. Um, rhinoceros. Okay, I'm going to go back over my results. This one is the best. If I could... Oh, come on. There we go. That one's the best. Camel is out. A little bit too much civet for me. If it'll focus. Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Oh. Okay. There we go. Camel is out. Rhinoceros is one I still have to test. I'm going to put Rhinoceros through the testing. And uh, that is it for me. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more content. More content will drop. Um, I will have Poetic Aromas review out soon. And I will be getting a few more samples or a few more fragrances in. And then I will be reviewing my own collection that is what the plan is thank you guys for watching hit that subscribe button also turn on the bell for notifications throw a like if you enjoyed and also comment what you think about zoologists and let me know once to try thank you guys